The newest member of the Army's helicopter fleet has arrived at Kandahar Airfield. The Apache Guardian made its way to the 16th Combat Aviation Brigade, where the crew worked hours reassembling various flight, electronic, and weapon systems. Earlier today, we were installing the main rotor system on the Echo Model Apache, installing new rotor blades. The new composite rotor blades, upon installation, will increase Guardian's cruise speed and payload capacity. The new design features are also a plus for crew members like specialist Tracy Burton when it comes to keeping the systems up and operational. Everything's pretty much the same tactically, but they made a lot of things easier for the maintainer. They removed a lot of wires, added some additional ports for us to hook up to, and overall everything is a lot easier to get to. Compared to the previous model, the Guardian has an upgraded transmission to accommodate more power as well as the capability to control unmanned aerial vehicles, making it a valued asset in combat operations. The end result is we have the ability to carry more ammo, more fuel in these high density altitude environment like Afghanistan. And uh, what that means to the end user is that we can bring more to the fight and stay there longer than a Delta model. Guardian will fly its first real world mission in the near future. Army Sergeant Rodney Roldan, Kandahar Airfield, Afghanistan.